Hi guys, welcome back to our homestead. It's been a long time since I've been here in the market, almost like about a year, because we've been working with the house, I've just been tied up, and I haven't been able to come to the market. But today we're actually at the market. I'm gonna be showing you around the market some fruits that fruits and vegetables that are different from here that we have actually here in Ecuador that you probably don't have in the United States. So I'm gonna be showing you around this market, a little bit how it looks and there's different fruits and vegetables out here. So make sure you keep watching to the end. Okay, so we're out here at the market and I'm gonna go ahead and do some walking around showing you some places, some things. And so the first thing I wanna point out is like the plantains. This is basically a huge stock of plantains. It's called plantains and they're, we use them to cut them, we cut them up and make chips or something out of them, that's what we do. We have, we make like chips, they're, I guess you could say a type of banana, but it's really kind of a plantain. Now this right down here is a small banana, okay, that's a banana. This is a ripe plantain, that's a small banana, and your, your head's probably spinning, but there's all kinds of different things that you gotta just get uh, used to, but like, I'm trying to think more, show you, think more things to show you, and make you think. And we've got, of course, tomatoes, and vegetables. And so that, oh, over here, I want to show you this real quick. This right here is a, I guess you could say like a dragon fruit right here. And so it's, you pop it open, it has like this, uh, it's kind of has this fruit inside, and you can eat that. And over there, right over there, that is tree tomato, I've showed you that before. Um, I'm not, I, is that pomegranate? I don't know. But that's a mango right there. And is this grand, that's a grandilia. That's grandilia right there. Grapes, of course. And I think that is guava banana, if I'm not mistaken, that's guava banana. And those are big, you know, of course, watermelons. And I think, um, Everybody doesn't see YouTubers around. Strawberries, plums, pears, and I'm trying to point out some more things. Let's see, there's a lot more different things here that I'm trying to see what I can point out to you guys. There's potatoes, of course, there. Uh, what are those things? There's those. I, I can't, sometimes I can just forget the name, and it's just so frustrating when I forget. Avocado, I'm sorry. That's an avocado right there. And so now over here, there's that, I don't know the name of that, but that's an interesting type of food or vegetable, whatever that is. I forgot that, what that was. And so, thinking over here, looking for another thing to show you. I'm gonna walk back here to the chicken area where they sell the chickens. I'm not even looking at the camera. So this is where, I'm getting close to where they sell the chickens. And so back here they actually sell chickens, let me see, this is kind of stands like this. And so here's the chicken. And so you can see the chickens right there that they peeled and stuff, that's how they sell them here. Over there, there's fish, right over there, there's fish. And over here I believe there is beef and probably some pig. Which we don't eat pig, but people eat pig, so, you know. This, I believe, is beef. I'm pretty sure this is beef. I'm not, wait a minute, no. It's, it's actually pig, maybe. I don't know. I'm not good at determining meat. I'm not good at, very good at all, determining meat-wise stuff. And so you can actually, so there's more guava banana, I believe that is. Guava banana, apples. Apples aren't grown here. They're grown in Chile. Uh, unless there are certain types of apples that grow here, but those are, you know, those aren't very good. And so there's oranges, peaches, granadilla, pomegranate, I'm guessing. This is, oh man, I should know the name of that. I forgot. But anyways, yeah, I forgot. There's so many names running through my head, and I'm just... Well, so this is ground cherry right here. We have that growing on the homestead. Actually, we... Actually... Okay, well we chopped it down because it got all weeded up and I, we just, we're gonna start over. So now I'm walking over here towards the chicken area. And so this is where they like sell the chickens. See, they're just tied up by the legs right there. They just tie them up by the legs and there's geese over there. 
and there's ducks. And I, I don't, oh, the guinea pigs are over there in that cage over there, but probably can't see them. We actually have guinea pigs we're selling, so I'll show you those real quick. Let me go over there real quick, because I believe they're selling some things, unless if there's, we have business. And so these are the, these are actually the, yeah, these are actually our friends. These, this is their stand. They sell a bunch of things, and so, you know, I think now they're selling, okay, so yeah, they got, I don't know the name of this. This is, I wish I, I there's so many things I don't know the name of, I still, but I know this mango. I know pretty much some of the fruit. <laughs> this, is this pita haya? That's a really small pita haya if that's pita haya. But I don't think so. Maybe. I don't know. So, ultimately, that's it. I might try. Oh, yeah, I want to show you something over up here. And so, uh, then I'll go back to this, our stand in a minute. So, I'm going to go up here. I'm, I'm just, people are, it's, it's Mother's Day actually, I'm cameraing this on, so it's Mother's Day right now, and so this is actually said to be pretty busy, but, um, I don't know, it might be a little bit, but anyways, I just thought I'd just go over here, and, yeah, this is the plant area, it says, no, no toca, don't touch any plants, basically, so, can't touch any plants, but you can see, like roses and all different types of flowers. My mother's been, what she's been doing is she's been make, uh, she's been growing the plants, but then she's selling them. So that works out really well to them. Been selling them to them. And so you got like, I believe mandarina trees. I'm not sure what that is. But anyways, there's a lot of things I don't know. I wish I knew everything, but I don't. And the word of the day for you guys is Marcado, market. Okay, so that's the word for the day. Now I'm gonna go back to our stand right over here. It's a small stand. We don't have like a huge stand. We just did it for this Sunday, so we're doing it right now. So I'm gonna show you what we're selling the guinea pigs. Guinea pig wise, we have like four guinea pigs. Let's see them. They're very skittish. And we're selling banana bread, banana, banana bread muffins, pan de canel. We're doing pretty good with that. And then Mother's Day cards and baby clothes. And then pineapple plants and some other plants that we're selling. So I pretty much have covered it all. I mean, we got that, that, ate, that place right over there. So that make all kinds of stuff. And so ultimately that is and to wrap all the market, the whole entire market, I hope I didn't cover things too fast. I'm trying to get everything worked out and show you all guys what the market looks like. So, I'm probably waving around the camera too much. I mean, this is a big place. It's huge. And I believe in the very corner back there, they have like a place where you can go and eat. But every market is going to be different. This is just one market. And the whole entire, you know, provenance of the whole entire country of Ecuador. So there's lots more markets. Markets in, in different kinds of towns. So, so, here's more plantains. Those are all plantains. I can tell that they're all plantains by just looking at them. They look different. And so, I, because I think it's the, the, the um, has something to do with the bottom part. It's, it looks different to me. You'll, if you look at a plantain and a banana, you'll understand that that is plantain. Don't get fooled. That's plantain. So, but you can make a sweet chip if you cut them up when they're sweet, when they're, when they're uh, yellow. You can make a kind of a tart chip, which we like more if they're green. So, you yeah, actually might want to cut them up green because it tastes better. And we got carrots. Carrots, onions, pineapple, right there. And so now, the one thing I really don't like about this is getting further back into these stands back here. Uh, there's more, uh, I guess you could say, Indians, and they tend to put a higher price on us Americans, and we really don't like that. 
Okay, so this is right over here, just a, a place where they cook stuff and sell food. I'm not sure exactly if they just have another random stand. This is like kind of a substitute. Oh, and there's two honeybees right there. <laughs> cool. Two honeybees. Since I'm in the bee business, you know, I like getting stung every once in a while. I was thinking about picking up a bee and stinging me on the chin. I need to be stung on the chin more. So, there's all kinds of stuff I thought I'd show you guys, bring you along for this because, you know, I've been wanting to do this, this, I, I want, I've been wanting to do this video for quite some time and I really haven't gotten the chance to because I've just been busy. And so now I just thought I'd want to make the video for you guys. So, yeah. That's where they sell the meat over there. That's the bathroom. Some people say you gotta pay 10 cents to go use the restroom. And so I think that's just like American type of thing. You know, Ecuadorian is free, but Americans, you gotta pay a little bit, okay? So, yes, uh, I, I hate that stuff, but that's what they do all the time. It's frustrating, but you just, it's how it works. The juice, it's just how it works. They, they think every, every American is rich, and we're not rich, we're out here selling stuff. And they want to put a higher price on us because, well, we're Americans. That's how it goes. And there's quail eggs right here, quail eggs right there, eggs right there, just normal eggs. And so, I believe those eggs, those not quail eggs, but the other eggs, the chicken eggs, they sell for about 10 cents each, I think. Is that correct? I'm not sure. About 10 cents each, I'm not sure. But anyways. So that's the market, right there. So I'm going to go up to the front and get a good lookout for you guys. And then I'm going to go and stock it. And I'm going to go and pretty much, you know, close the video out. So... Yeah, let me get up there real quick. I'm gonna go up there. So I'm up here at the front. The road's right over here, so a bus comes past every once in a while and picks people up from the market. And so I just thought I'd show you the big lookout of the market right here. So it's a pretty big market, guys. It's really big. So I thought I'd show you that. I thought I'd show you that real quick, guys. So Thanks for watching. Make sure you subscribe for more videos like this one. And I'll see you next time on Ecuador Homestead.